What up, y'all? It's your boy, Plant Man P. Look terrible right now. Well, let me fix this. Ah, much better. What up, y'all? It's your boy, Plant Man P. And if you want a little tutorial on what I just did, let me know. I know you guys um, in the comments on Instagram. One day I posted a picture of the plant care tea, and all of y'all were literally commenting on my hair, talking about how y'all got a clean fade during this quarantine. How y'all line up so fresh? I'll show you how if you guys want me to. I've been cutting my own hair for like probably like four years, so I think I know a thing or two. All right, y'all. We have a surprise here. I know I said I would never order another plant online, but I figured how bad can this type of plant be? So wish me luck. I don't really remember what I got. I know I got a, a type of plant, but I don't remember what it looks like, so we'll see. You guys are gonna see it with me. So far, so good. Before I start, what do you guys think of this? Wrong. All right. Oh, it already came packaged or with the pot, so that's pretty cool. See that? This is another Strophidum to add to the collection. Uh, Strophidum ornatum, ornatum. This was one that I don't have, and it's cool because it already comes with the dressing, and it's the same type of uh, style that I like to put on it, or colorway that I like to put on it, so that's cool. Uh, this was from plantdesert.com, and no, I, this is not a sponsored video whatsoever. Um, I just wasn't able to find this anywhere um, locally. So even though this is local, this is Fallbrook, California, but I just decided to um, go ahead and order something online. Just a, a one for content and two just to see, um, just to give online shopping and online plant shopping another chance. And I'm pretty, um, pretty impressed. So let me go ahead and Take off this plastic here. Again, this was from uh, Planet Desert. So I would give them a, a, I would definitely buy something from them again. Oh, and, and another thing that was cool, I don't know if it was because like, I honestly uh, added this to my cart like six times, but it just backed out. I don't know why, I just, just couldn't pull the trigger. And they actually sent a $5 credit to PayPal. Um, now, I'm not saying that it's going to work for you all the time, but that's what I did. I, um, move this out I like kept ordering or I kept putting it on my cart or in my cart. And probably like after the third time, I ended up getting a notification from PayPal saying, you've received a $5 credit from Planet Desert. And I'm like, oh, we lit. So I went ahead and uh, placed that order. And it came out to, I guess, $7.25, so that's not bad. So again, this is a Astrophidum ornatum, or I believe that's how you say it. It even comes with the little label, which is pretty dope. Man, I'm gonna have to clean all this up. This is terrible. So it comes with this that we can put on there. Try to focus. Planetdesert.com, Astrophidum them or not them and here is the final product definitely satisfied especially being traumatized by other um, online experiences especially this being so big I was not expecting that 
which of course I'm not complaining. I'm more thrilled than anything. Um, I was more expecting more of a, a smaller one, but super fire nonetheless, the fact that it's bigger. So um, let me go ahead and I'm putting the, the rocks back in. So let me go ahead and find a place for it um, with its friends, with all the homies, the balcony boys. Hopefully it gets along with them. Almost forgot. We got some other stuff to open up too. This is from, oh shout out to Drawn by Four for Plant Lady P's birthday, he drew her. I'll put his Instagram down below. We'll frame this and we'll update you guys and show you guys what it looks like framed. And this is from the homie Plant Minded on Instagram. Make some super dope stuff. I've always wanted one of these. And finally got one. So I don't know which way to open it. But we're gonna figure this out. But yeah, finally, um, I always wanted one of these and I finally got one. So super excited to see what it looks like and see where, where we can put it and what we can put in it. it smells like Sports Authority. Oh, it even comes with the, oh, that's dope. All right, so it says, Plant Minded, thank you for your purchase and support. I love seeing how these pieces fit into their new homes. Feel free to share any photos or tag the IG. Here's to hoops and hoardy culture. Stay plant-minded as always. Happy planting. Super fire. Here it is. It's a, a hanging planter, but it's a basketball. That's super dope. Ball is life, you feel me? Can't wait to figure out what we're gonna do with it, where we're gonna put it. Super shout out to him. Came out super dope. So shout out to Plant Minded. Make sure you guys check out his content and follow him on Instagram as well. Also, if you guys didn't know, anytime a larger leaf comes off or comes up on a allocation regal shield, this happens. So now you have one of two choices. One, you can cut it off which is sometimes a recommended choice or option, or two, just let it die on its own. So the benefit of cutting is it gives the energy to the new growth and any other new growth to come, which there's some right there if you guys can see. Um, so if you just keep it like this, it's essentially the plant is just wasting energy. So I think we're gonna have to cut this that simple and then this will just turn like that on its own then you can just do away with this it's gonna die in like a couple of days or you can just keep it as a souvenir <laughs> so here's what the plant looks like now still super healthy all we did was just uh, cut off some uh, hanging pieces of it so now, I gotta straighten this out, but so now we can just leave it like that. And then this piece, like I said, will just uh, brown off on its own. And then new growth will continue to come. We got some new growth here. As you see how it's kind of leaning on this side? So a way to fix that is just simply facing the side you want it to lean closer to, so this side towards the sun and it'll straighten out. But here's what it looks like now. This plant is so hard, oh my God. All right, so we got this little hook here. All we do is just screw it on or screw it into the roof. Ceiling. Ceiling, same difference. But yeah, that's all you do. So hopefully it's as easy as it sounds. I'm too short for this. Like this, right here. Right? Wait, where are you putting it? Right here is cool. 
Okay, start from the, are you doing it? Yeah. I can't see. Well, you don't need to show that. I'm too short for this. Maybe you can speed it up. Uh, is it in my like yeah. So here's what it looks like. Like it's turned all the way? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. That's good. Ugh. Oh, I look so cute. You mean you should like, can I straighten it up somehow? Yeah, hold on. Alright. Straighten it out a little bit. Oh, it goes nice with this. Uh -huh. <laughs> so that's what it looks like. Super fire. Again, shout out to Plant Minded for lacing us. Now let's do some cinematics. Alright y'all, that's gonna be a wrap for today's video. Thank you guys so much for sticking around till the end. And if you are not subscribed yet, go ahead and do so. It helps us out and it helps you out if you enjoy our content. And if you guys want me to do a tutorial on how to cut hair, I know this is a plant channel, but if you want me to do that because I know your significant others probably want a haircut during this quarantine and y'all probably looking rough, so just let me know and I'll go ahead and do a tutorial on how to do it. I won't get into too much detail because I'm not a barber. I just literally went on YouTube. Oh, went on YouTube. <laughs> I went on YouTube and just figured it out myself. So trial and error, I'm not a barber, so I won't get into detail like I said. But let me know if you want one, I'll do one. But again, that is a wrap for today's video and we'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.